In tonight's Dine on a Dime, we're taking you inside a gelato cafe where hundreds of ingredients like fig, goat cheese, Guinness, and vanilla bean become melt-in-your-mouth flavors. Best part? The low prices. KCAL 9 Entertainment reporter Christina McClarty gives us a taste. It is the cream of the ice cream crop. A little bit messy. Take a look inside Silver Lake's Pazzo Gelato. The great thing about Pazzo Gelato and why it made one of our hot tens are because it is a source from the farmer's market. It's fresh, it's local. In this month's issue of Bon Appetit, the magazine put Pazzo Gelato on its list of top ten ice cream shops. The magazine says the hip L.A. spot turns farmer's market ingredients into fantastical flavors of gelato. This is chevra with fig. Yeah. So you don't think of goat cheese with figs as making a great ice cream, but here it's a little bit sweet, a little bit savory, delicious. Delicious ideas are born at the farmer's market. Owner Mike Book says he visits L.A. markets twice a week. So far, he's created more than 300 fresh flavors. I want to see you make some gelato. Let's go. Book took us inside his kitchen and whipped up a fresh batch of dark chocolate gelato. Book uses local produce and dairy, and he stresses hormone and pesticide-free ingredients. And so, you know, a lot of it is educating, but the main thing is, is the experience, the flavor, the intensity. The sweet ending, beautiful gelatos, and all sorts of interesting flavors. It does. It's a vanilla base, so it's a Madagascar vanilla bean base, and then it's infused with the Guinness Extra Stout. Is that incredible? This is the farmer's market blood orange, sorbetto, so it's water-based, dairy-free. Very rich. It's perfect for summertime. It's so refreshing. Yeah. Refreshing bite and price. One of the simple pleasures of using local ingredients, the low cost. A two flavor order runs $3.95. People are addicted and they get really angry when their flavor's not here. Sometimes we take people's telephone numbers and we actually call them saying, hey, your flavor's in. All right, if you have a dining on a dime suggestion, just head to my blog, kcal9.com slash Christina. And guys, amazing flavors. You could never get bored there. For now, we're live in Hollywood. I'm Christina McClarty, KCAL 9 News. Back to you. Okay, hang on a second, Chris Christina. What, what about the Guinness gelato? Let's Come on, let's be honest. Did you I try know. it? <laughs> I did, Rick, and this is like every guy's dream. And for the women who don't drink beer, I swear to you, it is amazing. It has like a chocolatey malt kind of cinnamon wow. thing going on. Wow, it's Very, wow. very, very good. Do you they know, serve you it got with me <laughs> with the chocolate. What are you going to ask? I was if they serve it with pretzels. You can't have yeah, beer absolutely. without pretzels. All right, thanks, Well, Christina. you can do like a little side of pretzel there with the go. Guinness. <laughs> I'll sprinkle. just take a triple chocolate, Christina. Thank you.